beautiful I am coming to you today with another unboxing video today I'm going to be showing you the always wig by Raquel Welch and the color is golden russet I'm interested to see what this wig will look like um, looking online uh, it says it has a memory cap to base um, for its cap so I don't know what that means specifically or if there's anything different about it right off the bat looking at it doesn't look very different um but it does have a card right on the front that told me that it's been packaged inside out to maintain its style so that's really cool a lot of wigs come inside out don't let that deter you especially oh nope there's definitely hair netting on it so that's good all right oh this is a pretty color all right before we turn it inside out let's take a look at this cap shall we um so when I said memory, memory cap, I was thinking it would probably have silicone or something, but I don't see any silicone. Um, it's likely talking about these, these wefts through here. Um, as the, I'm sorry, not the wefts, but the, the cap where the wefts are sewn to. Those look different than I've actually seen before. I'll get those closer so you guys can see them, but it, it looks a little different than I'm used to. It's got these tiny little like threads like weaving throughout them uh it actually looks really really cool i'm interested to see what this does after wearing it for a long time it's meant to uh, online it says that this particular cap is meant to essentially adjust to your head over time and remember your head shape which is supposed to lead to more comfort so um i will check that out i'll wear it for a while and see if that happens <laughs> um so other than that though it is a completely open weft to cap design uh, it looks like it's more of a basic cap with no lace front here in the front, but it does have this really nice felt lining, um, which will be nice and comfortable for right here if you're losing your hair. Uh, it actually has open ear tabs, which are pretty rare. Um, if you have not seen me, where'd it go? Sorry, stepping around the computer, grab my glasses. If you haven't seen me talk about open ear tabs before. Uh, if you have an open ear tab, the cool thing about them is that when you're wearing your glasses, you can actually stick your glasses through the ear tab um, instead of trying to lay them on top or trying to laying them underneath, which is not very comfortable to me. Um, so I actually like open ear tabs, so that's really cool. And then the back has a felt covered nape for the Velcro adjusters, but it is not extended. Um, overall, I would say, ooh, oh, that's what it does. Look at how much I can stretch this. Okay, so that's elastic. These are elastic through here. Um, it's an average cap, but oh my God, I've never seen a wig cap actually stretch that much that was not hand tied. That's pretty crazy. Um, very beautiful curl pattern through here. Definitely a lot of layers shorter in the front. You got some shorter pieces here. Um, let me take the tags off and we'll brush her through and see what that curl pattern looks like after being combed out. Uh, all Raquel Welch wigs, well, I don't want to say all, but all that I have ever had are a part of the true-to-life fibers. This one is no different, uh, which means that it is heat-friendly up to 350 degrees um, or 180 degrees Celsius. So 350 Fahrenheit, 180 Celsius. Let's go ahead and give her a quick little comb through and see what the curl pattern looks like after. quite long. Looks like the nape alone is 13 inches. So this is the curl pattern after I've given her a quick comb through. Still very, very pretty. Let's go ahead and pop her on. This is an incredibly comfortable wig. Right off the bat, those elastic pieces where the wefts are, that's not playing around. It's definitely, this would accommodate a larger head size for sure as well. All right, so let's get it all combed out. All right, so since it has a basic cap, uh, no lace front, and actually this is sticking, protruding out a little bit more since it is a little bit more, not big, but adjustable for the elastic. Um, so if this was a wig I'm gonna be keeping, I would definitely cut a full bang in it. 100% I would cut a full bang. I would not try to side sweep these bangs just because it does lay off of your, at least my head, uh, quite significantly 
right there. We pull it back just a little bit. Um, I'm pulling these in the front here, but you don't have to. If you don't like having a bunch of hair towards the front of your face, uh, you could just leave those back and then you only have these little face framing layers. But if you want to pull some forward, you absolutely can. Um, or you can leave it more back and just have these layers here. So let me do a 360 so you can see what she looks like on all sides. Right. Uh, let's take a look at the measurements. So the front, which would be the actual front front here, uh, is actually six and a half inches. Um, and since I have a seven inch face, that is actually a perfect little measurement there. Um, but if you want to obviously just cut straight across, um, if you want to cut bangs in it or take it to your stylist, you can also take it to your stylist and they can cut it for you. Uh, the crown measures 9.5 inches. The sides measure eight inches. The back is also eight inches and the nape is 13 inches. So obviously much longer in the back than it is in the front. Um, I can actually almost, well, I can touch it. It's, it's resting like right above my bra strap. So quite long in the back actually. Um, it has a weight of 4.75 ounces. Um, I will say that this cap is pretty dang comfortable. I mean, I don't really feel like I'm wearing a lot on my head. Um, the felt's going a long way up here for comfort, as well as the fact that it's that memory cap, so it just stretched a ton. Um, that is actually feeling quite comfortable on my head. It feels not snug, but it also doesn't feel like it's gonna come off or that it's loose. My wig grip is doing a perfectly good job keeping it on my head, um, but it would just, it would accommodate a larger head. All right, let's take a look at this color. So this is the color Golden Russet. Very warm, very, very warm shade. Um, so it's, it's the color is described as a blend of medium and light auburn. So definitely some through here, as you can see, some darker, redder auburn colors. Um, and then mixed with a golden blonde. So golden denotes that it's going to be a warmer color. So that's what you're seeing through here. And this darker is definitely a beautiful auburn shade. So I'll get a little bit closer so you guys can see that. Very, very pretty color, definitely on the warmer side. So if your skin tones can't handle the warmer colors, mine doesn't handle like super warm colors all that well. Um, but it is a very pretty color, especially if you're a little bit more tan than me, you could probably pull it off. <laughs> all right, if you want to pick up Always by Raquel Welch or any of their gorgeous wigs, um, you can head on over to wigstudio1.com. Uh, there, while you're checking out, make sure to look for a flash sale. If one exists, it will automatically apply your discount um, at checkout for you. So no need to worry about any of those coupon codes. It'll go ahead and do the job for you. Also, while you're online, make sure you head on over to our Facebook group. We have a Facebook group called Wig Studio One Wig and Topper Support Group. Um, there you're gonna find myself, the employees of Wig Studio One, as well as thousands of other ladies there to help support you. All right, until next time, bye-bye beautiful.